All right, 2014 Legend Stock winner in the Pro Division and overall, Trey Gerald. Trey, uh, KBM, KBR car was pretty well hooked up tonight. Looks like you had a class of field and pretty much put a whooping on him. How's that win for you? Oh, it's awesome. An awesome feeling. And uh, we've been working on our setup all season, trying to get it good and at Charlotte. Uh, to shoot out. I figured we'd have a chance and uh, it just really paid off. And I'm glad we capped our summer off that way. And I'm going, going to go back to school on the 11th and uh, this is kind of my last deal before, before summer ends so it couldn't really end a, a better way but I just got to thank everybody at Cal Beauty Racing and uh, they worked so hard on this car and I'm glad that we were able to you know, come up here and win and have it pay off. Yeah, he had a rough, rough shootout. He had a fast car but just a lot of bad luck down there all summer. And Kind of a midweek decision to come on up here and, and run Legend Stock, and I guess you guys picked a picked a good place to come out with a big victory and pretty cool trophy. Yeah, definitely. Um, we were down on horsepower just a little bit at Charlotte, and that made things difficult. But uh, we figured we'd come here, and it's a little smaller track, and uh, it played right into our hands, really. And uh, the car was a little bit loose when the race started, and the more laps that we ran, the more it came in. So uh, it just really kind of all fell together for us. And, it made it easier to pick up a win. He had a good start, beat Ferguson off of the second corner off there and got the lead right away and pretty much never looked back from that point on. Did you see all the chaos behind you during the race? I did. I didn't know if it was ever going to end. And I, I hope nobody got hurt. Uh, that was kind of one of my concerns. But um, I, I don't know. It just worked out for me. On uh, numerous occasions, things happened. It fell right into my hands and uh, put it in place for me to win. Uh, it's pretty awesome. Another win here at Legend Stock. Uh, another Another pro winner. We thought we were going to have Young Lions winner, but Trey Gerald, Pro Division driver, comes out on top again. We've got sponsors here, we got to thank for winning. Um, it's probably the race of the day. <laughs> but i got to thank everybody, though. Kyle and Neil and Adam, who worked on our car, and uh, John. John and Todd. So, pretty awesome day. Pretty awesome. Congratulations, Trey. Legend Sack 2014 and about the Motor Speedway here with the Young Lions winner, second place overall, Stevie Johns Jr. Stevie, it was a last-minute decision to come on up here and run this Legend Stock race. I guess you're pretty happy with the result, huh? Yeah, we decided about 6 p.m. last night at Bowman Gray if we were going to come here or not, but we thought we can't win it if we're sitting at home on the couch. So we came on out, and we had a fast car with uh, some last-minute decisions. Looks like Gerald was a little bit quicker uh, overall on the, on the line. you got anything for him, or just pretty much just not enough in the car to get to him? We were digging at the beginning, the first seven cars were all in a line about equally fast with each other. But once the big wreck happened up in one and two, I uh, hit something in the front end and after that it wasn't as good. Looked like a good solid trip, you get a pretty cool guitar to take home with you. Uh, pretty happy with that, what's your plans for the rest of the season now? Well, we got to fix the car from tonight and uh, I don't really know. We'll decide at uh, 6 o'clock some more races. All right, you got anybody you got to thank for getting you out here tonight? Yeah, first off, I'd like to thank uh, Josh Brimacombe for letting me use his right side tires. It means a lot to us. We'll make it up to you. Brell Bell Housings and BMF Racing Heads, Chase Bastone Inc. for setting up this wicked fast car tonight. Legend Stock 2014 semi-pro winner, Devin O'Connell, uh, about seventh overall and officially. Pretty crazy wild race. Uh, you had a couple wild incidents yourself. Uh, pretty satisfied, I guess, with the semi-pro victory. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, semi-pro victory here. Uh, first, it's just, it's just awesome. This, I've never seen this place before coming into tonight, and uh, was able to pull off the semi-pro victory after uh, getting involved with that huge wreck up front. And, uh, felt like I had a better car than a seventh place tonight, but uh, you know, at the, uh, even though as crazy as tonight was, I mean, you can't complain. I mean, semi-pro win. I'm bringing home one of the guitars and uh, just move on to the next one and hopefully do better. Yeah, the first year in Legend Cars, you're uh, up there in semi-pro points overall. Almost won the shootout championship. Turn that around and come here, get a big you know, semi-pro victory with a stout field of cars in Bethel. Uh, what's the plans for the rest of the season? Not 100% sure. We're gonna, well, I, one thing that is 100% sure is that uh, we're going to finish out the Allison Lakes Tour and uh, just kind of go wherever uh, there's a race, I guess, in the Legends. Um, if I'm off in the Allison, we'll just go out and run. And, uh, just uh, have fun. As we're talking off camera, you're going to run for the semi pro championship next year. That's still, still the plan, right? That's what the plan is, and uh, hopefully, we can get the sponsorship money to do that. And uh, obviously, I've proven uh, this year that uh, I'll be a contender next year for the national championship. 
You got sponsors anybody want to thank for getting this win tonight? Thanks to the Chatham Island Motel, 860 Motorsports, putting together a fantastic car. Thanks to my dad, um, my parents, for uh, making the trip up here from North Carolina. And uh, thanks to uh, Racing Rules and um, Bethel Motor Speedway for uh, hosting this awesome event. All right, congratulations, Devin O'Connell, on the uh, semi-pro victory tonight here at Bethel Motor Speedway in Lundstock here with, uh, 2014. Lundstock Masters winner, fifth place overall this year, Richie Coy. Richie, pretty quiet race for you. Nobody really noticed you were out there until the end when uh, we were looking to see who was left in the field. The car came away pretty much unscathed. Now you're pretty ecstatic with that uh, Masters trophy tonight. Uh, it's, it was one of our goals. We had two goals to win to do this year. One of them was to get this trophy. The other one is to get the overall points championship, and we're leading the points, have been leading the points. So hopefully we can get that goal as well. But tonight was an awesome, awesome race. You guys had a pretty fast car in practice. Um, a little bit off in qualifying. Real good heat race. Any other compl complications with the car tonight? Or uh, we actually fought it all day long. Um, for some reason, with this new setup that we have on the car, we've been fighting it a little bit with the brakes and stuff. So um, it was a pretty eventful day to have a very uneventful uh, race, which was good. Um, went from 17th to 5th. Um, we have to basically put a front bumper on the car, and that's it. So all four wheels are on it. All four fenders are on it. Um, I can't be. I couldn't be happier. Your plans are to finish out the Bethel season and win that championship, hopefully. Uh, hopefully. What are you going to do after that? Are you just going to call the season? Um, no. Um, I just gave, uh, well, I didn't just give, my wife just gave birth to uh, uh, my new daughter, so um, she'd really like me to kind of scale back a little bit. So um, I doubt we'll quit, but we may scale back a little bit next year. But um, hopefully winning the championship before we go out would be a, definitely the way to go out. Congratulations on the, the newborn, and congratulations on the uh, Masters overall guitar victory. Fifth place overall, and uh, we'll come competitive Legend Stock event. you got to be pretty sick with that. you got sponsors. Anybody got to thank for getting you out here tonight? Um, just Mach 1 Performance, um, AMS Oil, Fluid, Fluidine, Draco Springs, um, that and my, uh, my basically my crew guys over there. They uh, worked all day long, changed springs, changed uh, brake pads, did all kinds of stuff and ended up with a good night. So it was cool. Congratulations, Richie Coy, the Masters winner here in Legend Stock 2014. Thank you very much.